Greetings fellow Wastelanders, Timberwolf here, another Fallout 76 adventure. Um, continuing on my solo events, today we're doing uh, the, um, the, oh my lord, my brain, <laughs> line of the sand, okay. Hey, this is a great one too if you're hunting spooky scorch because we're going to get a buttload of them, um, so this is awesome great event to pop up and honestly it's actually not that hard to solo um what you want to do first before you go and hit that also if you're soloing this or not soloing this don't just jump in there and hit that pre pre contact check right away okay look at the timer you got a few minutes so first thing go around repair these turrets take out the uh the scorch that are already hanging around here okay because you're going to get so many more might as well um, try to cut down the numbers a little bit. But go around here, repair these laser turrets if you can. You may not have the resources yet to do it, especially if you're a newer character. Um, but if you've got them, go for it. Get them, because these are going to help you a lot. Okay? Don't think that they're going to take away Scorch from you, because honestly, there are going to be so many that you're going to need all the help you can get. You don't want to fail the event. So... Yeah, let's uh, let's get all those going, and then get this big guy going, okay? Because he's going to help you against the scorch beasts that are going to be assaulting you, okay? Now, if I'm if I'm doing this in public, I usually wait until I'm down to the last minute before I go ahead and hit the combat check and get it ready. Um, since I'm not in public, I'm in private. Then it's not going to really make any difference at all. I've got all the scorch cleared. I've got all the turrets ready to go. So what the heck? Let's do it. Now, I recommend having a good number of nuke, nuke grenades or whatever available. That's going to help out a lot. What you're going to want to do here is guard this sonic generator, because that's what everything's going to be targeting. Don't worry too much about the Scorch Beast when it comes, because you're rarely going to get a shot at it anyways. Um, you want to focus on the Scorch that are going to come running in at you, trying to destroy the, the, the generator. Now, you're going to see different waves are going to come from different directions. Usually, they're going to come from either this side or this side. And there's going to be a whole lot of them. What sometimes helps is toss a nade that way. Toss another one that way. Okay. And then just... Yeah. Yeah, see the Scorch Beast is behind us, it's not even high enough to reach, so I'm not going to spend a lot of time worrying about it. Even though the Holy Fire is always my number one go-to, um, for this situation, the, the Fixer is really, really kind of key here. Oh. Who's hitting me? Uh, I don't see anybody. Oh, there we go. Load up again, nice. far away to know whether or not any of those were spookies. We'll find out later when uh, when we've completed this.
Just uh, pretty self explanatory. The sound generator barely holding on. We got to hold out for another six minutes. for exploding bullets. Line in the sand. Told you that wasn't hard. Two cores, three treasury notes. Not terrible. All right, now let's go looking for some spookies. There's one here. Um, there's another one. I don't want whatever that is. Oh, this sucks. I'm trying to do the transfer. There we go. There we go. Yeah, the two star. I'll take that one. Uh, uh, executioner's chainsaw, one star. You know what? What the hell? Chainsaws sell very well, especially if you add the dual bar flaming um, mods. That'll sell very, very well. Other than that, yeah, usually I don't pick it up if it's less than... Uh, Less than two stars. Any more? So that, another tree bag. That's three we got here so far. At least in range of here. Now, I've, as we come out further out, we might find some more. A couple stragglers out here. Check these poop piles too. Death claw hands. You can make death claw gauntlets with those. The extra, the extra blade. Um, nothing there. Eh. Another death client. Money. grab as all the ammo that I can find. I mean, free ammo, why not? There's more candy. Oh, okay, no more spooky treat bags, at least here. Um, I wonder if 
I picked off any of them out here at all. Nope. No, that looks like it. That looks like it. So, we ended up taking out three uh, spookies in this place, in this event. Um, that's kind of underwhelming, honestly. Uh, most of the time, you're going to usually, from my experience, you're going to usually at least get five. Um, you know, but it was a, it was a relatively quick and easy, in, you know, um, uh, event. So, no, no big deal there, really. And uh, so, a great way to farm spookies. Um, get some cores and, and, uh, yeah, nice little event there. Perfect. All right. Uh, so head on out there and good luck on your spooky scorch hunting. I'm going to continue to do the same and uh, until the next adventure.